Let's have a quick look at myopia or nearsightedness. If you're lucky enough, you can see sights like this with great clarity and with no help at all. If you're nearsighted or myopic, distant objects will appear blurry while near objects are clear. How does all this work? In emetropia or neutral sightedness, distant objects appear clear with no focusing effort of the eyes. When we pull focus forward, this brings our far point of focus on the horizon to a point nearer to us, leaving the background blurred. In myopia or nearsightedness, the far point of focus is already closer than the horizon. Near objects naturally appear clear to our eyes, while the distance remains blurred. Any focusing effort still pulls the far point of focus nearer to us, and this makes distant objects appear even more blurred. In myopia, the eyes are naturally tuned to the near distance, where we tend to learn, read, and play. Children who have low to moderate myopia appear to have a distinct advantage in school as they experience much less near-tasking strain than those with the equivalent hypropia or farsightedness. While myopia may have its benefits in the classroom, progressive myopia is increasing worldwide to the point that it is being called a global epidemic. Progressive and high myopia can lead to extreme binocular vision concerns and health risks, including blindness. There are solutions for progressive myopia. It can be slowed and risks minimized. Learn more about myopia and treatments for it at visionmechanic.net. Thanks for watching.